<coughs> this is, I don't like this at all. I don't want randomized fucking bullshit. How do I get rid of cautious? Want to gamble at the tavern? Seems reasonable. Hello, Commander. I can't dig anything out because I don't have guys. Commander, I'm going to need more help on the engineering team before I can start clearing out some of these other rooms. Yeah, we're gonna need an engineering mission that doesn't have a relay that's not in range of my first four yellow moves. So that's gonna be really important. Use another scientist. Let's get our let's get our grenades. What the fuck is she going on about? Alright. One thing at a time. Grenades. Gorilla Tactics School now operational. <laughs> they got the bench press. It's easy. Once that's online, we're good. You're gonna become a, what these, what? There's no, there's no fucking assault. The ranger is not an assault. The ranger's got a fucking. The ranger's like the worst of the shinobi and the assault class combined. It has a shotgun. But it's never fast enough to actually use the shotgun. It has a sword, but the sword's not accurate enough to hit with. I don't know if that counts. I'm pretty sure it doesn't count. All right. This will prove to have been an important breakthrough. Commander, the science team has grown particularly interested in this field of research. So much so that their inspiration could lead to vast improvements in our research efficiency. However, we must act fast. Despite their brilliance, they are a fickle group. I will make that our highest priority. One acid grenade, one dragon rounds. I'm gonna go investigate that stockade. Dude, what's wrong with 39 days? What do you think we're doing with 39 days? There's a scientist over there I want too. But I figure I probably need this engineer more, huh? Since that worked, we might as well keep it up, Commander. Hey. Our friends in the Resistance have helped to pinpoint the location of our missing soldier. Commander, we've confirmed the position of the soldier being held captive by the Chosen. We now have an opportunity to launch a rescue operation. Siri, why why do you think that you're uh oh because you're counting you're next on the list I guess that's actually kind of true. Commander, it looks like conditions on the ground are ripe for a quiet operation. If we can get our people into place, they should each have concealed positions to work with. I can see both of these being really fucking useful.
All right. I thought I said make fodder. I'm like, that's not very optimistic. All right, specialist. Double grenades. Flashbang possibly going to be useful. Oh my god. We want an acid grenade? I kind of want an acid grenade. Oh, I'm Grenadier. Yeah, definitely a Grenadier. What am I saying? Let's do it. Oh, I feel like we're minutes away from mechs. Sky Ranger deployed. In position to drop. We've confirmed that the soldier taken captive during our previous operation is being held within a high security advent facility not far from your position. If we try to take them back by force, it won't be long before we're totally outnumbered by enemy reinforcements. Our best bet is to go in quietly, drawing as little attention as possible. The latest intel has our operatives being held in the main structure just ahead. We have the advantage of stealth here, so we should try to get in and out as quietly as possible. If the enemy spots us, this is going to get a whole lot harder. It is a fortified compound. Kind of have to expect there'll be someone paying attention to who's going in and out of it. I mean, I'm assuming. Moving out. I will reposition. Why does it not give me any more sight around that corner? Also, are these walls something I can jump? Looks like they are. Go this way? No. Will do. We have Firebrand on standby for evac, Commander, but as soon as she gets in range, the whole compound will go on high alert. We should hold back unless we have the target or it's an absolute emergency. I go where I'm needed. Stay clear of those turrets. We're still not entirely sure if they're fully automated or remotely triggered. My life is in your hands. Commander. I want to see in there if I possibly can. Moving as ordered. That patrol is coming. So how does the extract work for this? Is this like uh, Long War II style stuff where I can throw an evac beacon and it will alert, reveal my guys somewhat alert and uh, give me some time before it arrives or is it something entirely different? Let 
No pier once I have mocks. What changes the enemy's uh, alert level? Discovered unlocking the door, throwing your beacon. Okay. I don't really want another group, this is kind of perfect. carry him or is he gonna be able to move on his own <sighs> okay so I really need to start the turn here then it's action to pick him up or not not an action to pick him up Probably an action to open the door. Falk says I am to obey. Is hacking reveal? Or just up their security level? I do have a specialist. I guess I can hack from range. Okay. Affirmative covering now.
fucker. Okay. Infiltrating access point. Firebrand is in position and the compound is on full alert. Time to move. Hey, why are you revealed? You have a one tower reveal radius. I shouldn't be fucking revealed. That's what we call bullshit. No, no, not what I fucking said. Stand in the open. No. Oh. I need to teleport to cursor. Is it enabled? Yeah. There's no way we wouldn't be able to run around the side of that. I don't know what her movement's like, but I had. Did you guys see me looking for my mouse cursor because it removed my mouse cursor, and then it just like I clicked to get my mouse cursor and it, cursor and it moves there. Does she have reduced movement while she's moving or no? Do we know? How much reduced movement does she have? No? Okay, then she has plenty of move to get around the corner. So, hold on. How do I select her now? Where the fuck is she? Okay, there we go. All right. We can throw evac use at this turn too? What does that look like? Maximum alert status. They put out a distress signal and we're already picking up multiple inbound. Doesn't show me where they get shot, huh? Guess I can predict if who can see me. No, I'm gonna run through Overwatch doing that. Any of these guys have the ability to break Overwatch? Probably not. I wasn't really wanting another round of guys. I mean, I could just grenade these, I suppose. Kind of hoping just to walk out of here. Um, if we go here, are we visible? No. 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 Uh, one can see me for one tile, but one tile can't kill me. Can't shoot me. Doesn't trigger the Overwatch, but it's this one I'm more worried about. Just run it anyways. Does that run through all their Overwatch? Which one do I see? That one. That one again. It's just one shot. Yeah, I could aid protocol and run it with the engineer. Considering doing that. Grenade them both. If I grenade them both, I end my turn, and then I can't leave this turn, so I have to deal with whatever's coming out. Aid protocol is only half action. And I'd like to leave this turn. Okay. He's concealing the other two to position them. I can't conceal the guy he's carrying, and he's the one who triggers all the overwatch, so it doesn't really help me. And I could walk up and try to shoot them, but I don't actually want to engage here. There's a there's a chance I can pull if I go if I move forward at all or blow open any lines of sight. There's a chance I reveal. I think I'd rather just run Overwatch on troopers. It's pretty unlikely they're gonna hit me, especially with uh, aid protocol. So what I need to do is figure out which tiles this guy sees here, which I think are all of them, right? Yeah. I 
I'd like to do is get this cover. I wonder if I can get the cover bonus at all coming around here. I guess I could panic. That would be pretty bad. Alright, I think I'm going to do the aid protocol run it thing though. Like that. I guess I did it as a blue move. I was supposed to be a dash. And then it was going to be a toggled over here. Didn't want to pull both those shots. Fucking worked out, I guess, but it was not my, not my intention. That was supposed to be a control click for shift cues to move to the exit zone. Doesn't matter, though. It's just not really what I was intending to do. Swift. Doesn't look swift. The VIP is with me. We're on our way out. Parking it in. Okay. Get out of here. All XCOM operatives are secure. Firebrand is returning to base. Oh, close the big door. That would have been interesting. Actually, that wouldn't have been a bad idea to close the big door. Alright. By the clicking rather than double tapping the number. Uh, spite towards you in particular. I like that. Reminds me of our acid grenade, which is what they're going to be burning with. All right. That's twice on that mission that I tried to do something and the interface didn't do what I wanted it to do. It's a little bit scary. Oh, I'm sure they did, Aqua. but has been safely returned, Commander. He's eager to get back into the fight. You're bonding. I am glad to return to your service, Commander. I will not forget what you and your soldiers have done for me. What if he the dodges the wounds? And no casualties. You can lead the Reapers any day, Commander. Well done. One engineer, she don't say. So is he wounded from the first mission or did we dodge our wounds by doing this? Oh we dodged all those wounds. Easy game. Alright. Next on the list. <laughs> 